Trying to decide on the best new mountain bike helmet, after researching over 80 models, we purchased the 22 best available for side-by-side -side testing and comparison. A helmet is the most important piece of bike gear, and finding the perfect model for your riding style and budget can be challenging. To clear things up, we spent months riding in these helmets while analyzing every aspect of their performance and design. After thoroughly testing each model, we rated them on six predetermined metrics. Protection, comfort, ventilation, features, weight, and durability. We hope this detailed comparative review helps you find the right helmet for you. If you seek more coverage and protection than a half-shell helmet, we have also tested the best full-face helmets and a wide variety of other top bike helmets. We have completed testing and reviews for a wide range of mountain bikes and accessories, including biking knee protection and the best mountain bike shoes and flat pedal bike shoes to complete your riding kit. Editor's note, this review was updated on January 31st, 2023 to include some of our favorite full-face mountain bike helmets. Number 1. Gyro Radix Mips The Gyro Radix Mips is the latest in a long line of functional, affordable mid-range offerings from Gyro. With the shell shape of a classic mountain bike helmet, a comfortable fit, and a well-targeted list of features, this affordable helmet feels at home in a wide range of riding styles and conditions. The fit is versatile and incredibly secure feeling. As soon as you put the helmet on, Gyro's Rock Lock Harness allows you to dial in the fit to your exact preference, and remains one of the best fit adjustment systems on the market. The MIPS internal liner provides a little extra protection from rotational forces in the event that you hit the deck, and the EPS shell offers decent coverage. At just 360 grams for our size large test helmet, the Radix MIPS is also among the lightest helmets we tested. While it's a versatile, protective helmet, the Radix MIPS isn't quite as burly as many of the all-mountain and enduro-oriented helmets we tested. The more traditional shell shape doesn't drop quite as low on the back and sides of the head. Additionally, the visor is a bit small and flimsy when compared with modern agro helmets. Consequently, we wouldn't recommend this helmet as our top pick for aggressive all-mountain riding but it feels right at home for cross-country and trail riding. Number 2. Fox Racing Speed From Pro Despite its mid-range price tag, the Fox Racing Speed From Pro was one of our top-rated and most highly regarded helmets. This model nearly bested several helmets that cost significantly more. It packs many of the features we would expect from a top-of-the-line trail helmet, including a MIPS rotational impact system, dual-density EPS foam, a goggle accommodating adjustable visor, and a highly adjustable harness system. Out on the trail, it was one of the most comfortable, well-ventilated models we tested. It feels light on your head and offers a secure, confidence-inspiring fit. Additionally, it received the best available 5-star rating in Virginia Tech's independent helmet safety testing. The Speed From Pro is slightly heavier than the rest of the top-shelf models. It's not ridiculously heavy by any means, but it tacks on an extra 50 grams compared to the lightest models. Additionally, the Speed From doesn't quite provide the same level of coverage as the other top contenders. Regardless, it's still well worth a look for anyone in the market for a choice new lit at an approachable price. Number 3. Pock Cordal Race Mips The Cordal Race Mips from Pock stands out for its impressive protective qualities. The Cordal builds off the success of the ever-popular Tactile, with a deep fit and even more head coverage. It also features a new rotational impact protection system called Mips Integra, which is strikingly similar to Pox spin system. Although now it features a low-friction slip plane integrated into the foam of the helmet, this MIPS system is low-profile and has the added benefit of not blocking any of the vents or air channels in this very well-ventilated helmet. In fact, this is one of the airiest helmets we've ever tested. The Cordal also features a new three-position adjustable visor that is designed to easily break away in the event of a direct impact. Additional features like aramid bridges for structural integrity, a RECO reflector, and an NFC medical id chip further enhance its protective safety qualities. The Cordal also carries all of the usual safety certifications, in addition to the new Dutch standard for electric bikes. Our gripes with the Cordal are few but we did find a few nits to pick. We found the fit of the shell to be slightly narrower than most other helmets we tested, which may be an issue for those with particularly round head shapes. We think the new adjustable breakaway visor is great, although its position higher on the helmet limits its effectiveness at blocking low sun angles. The Cordal was designed to integrate with Pock's new Devour sunglasses, but we found that the shell by the temples could conflict with the arms of some other sunglasses. It's also pretty pricey. That said, we think the Cordal is worth every penny.
Number 4. Gyro Tyrant Spherical As part of a new wave of moto-inspired, open-face trail helmets, the Gyro Tyrant Spherical provides significantly more head coverage than most of the standard mountain bike helmets we tested. Gyro bills this beefy lid as a versatile option that can span the gap between gravity, trail, and dirt jump helmets. After weeks of rigorous testing, we support Gyro's claim that it's an incredibly versatile helmet, despite its heavy, protective construction. The first thing you'll notice when donning the Tyrant is that it shares a unique dual-shell construction with its half-shell counterpart, the Manifest. The inner shell is low-density EP foam for minor impacts, and the outer shell is high-density EPS to absorb major collisions. Despite its double-shell composition, the helmet keeps a relatively low profile on your head, and the vents do a surprisingly good job of keeping things cool. Combine the innovative protection and coverage with Gyro's rock lock harness system and refined shell shape, and you have a helmet that stays comfortable all day. While we hugely appreciated the Tyrant's extra coverage and protection when things got rowdy, it does come with a weight penalty. This product is far heavier than your standard half-shell trail helmet. It doesn't make you feel like a bobblehead like some of the heavier full-face helmets out there but you'll undoubtedly notice that it has more heft than your average lid. Given the Tyrant's intended purpose, we don't think the extra weight is a big problem. This model is perfect if you want to have fun on the trails and test your limits with the peace of mind provided by the protection from added coverage. Number 5. Smith Mainline Mips The Smith Mainline Mips rose to the top of our rankings in our full-face helmet review and we feel it is an excellent option for the majority of riders. Constructed with Smith's AeroCore technology and Corid material, this versatile model boasts a fairly lightweight and well-ventilated design that makes it usable for trail riding or enduro racing, where you need to pedal to the top of your descents. It also carries a DH certification and has been designed to withstand the rigors of downhill riding. The main line provides excellent coverage of the head, comes equipped with a MIPS liner intended to help dissipate the forces of rotational impacts and a sturdy D-ring buckle at the chin strap. Whether lining up at the regional enduro series, after work shuttles, occasional bike park days, or rowdy trail rides, the Smith Mainline is our top recommendation. Similar to other lighter weight helmets that are DH certified, the Mainline wouldn't be our first choice for riding lifts at the bike park frequently. Yes, it is designed to handle that type of riding, but we would opt for a more substantial and heavier helmet for true downhill riding. It will serve most people well for the occasional lift served day, but for pure gravity riding, we feel there are better options. Beyond that, we feel the mainline is an excellent, versatile helmet that should meet most people's needs. Number 6. Troy Lee Designs D3 Fibrolite With a price tag significantly lower than the top-tier DH helmets we've tested, we feel the Troy Lee Designs D3 Fibrolite represents a great value for a burly and protective full face. This helmet has a rugged Fibrolite shell that surrounds a significant EPS EP foam lining with a heavily padded and plush lining. The snug fit and wide chin strap that is secured with a sturdy D-ring buckle make for a confidence-inspiring and stable feel. When charging down chunky rock gardens or jump lines, it has classic styling and clean lines, and a large adjustable visor that works well to keep the sun out of your eyes. In this day and age, we were a little disappointed that the D3 Fibrolite doesn't come with MIPS or a similar rotational impact protection system. Yes, it still carries a DH certification and feels very protective, but we like all the added protection we can get. This beefy helmet is also on the heavier end of the spectrum and doesn't have the best ventilation, though for a dedicated gravity riding helmet. These concerns are relatively minor. Overall, we think the D3 Fibrolite is a quality DH helmet at an approachable price. Number 7. Fox Rampage Pro Carbon Mips If you're looking for a burly helmet for pure downhill riding or racing, the Fox Rampage Pro Carbon Mips is what we recommend. The robust DH helmet has a very substantial feel with a carbon fiber shell that surrounds a dual-density EPS foam lining with a MIPS slip plane for rotational impact protection. Generous padding and a sturdy D-ring chin strap closure ensure a secure fit on the head. The large visor is designed to break away for safety in the event of a crash, and it has decent ventilation, considering its beefy, protective design. For riding lifts and pushing the limits of speed and terrain, the confidence-inspiring Fox Rampage Pro Carbon is the helmet we'd reach for every time. The burly and protective nature of the Rampage Pro Carbon MIPS contribute to its overall weight, and it is among the heavier helmets we've tested. While it has decent ventilation, 
it can't compete with some of the lighter and more breathable models in terms of airflow. Both the weight and reduced ventilation mean that it isn't quite as versatile as other options. We also found that its sizing runs a little small, so we'd recommend trying one on if possible and potentially sizing up for the best fit. Beyond that, we feel this is the best true downhill helmet we've tested.